Let's talk about parallax and focus on your scope. If you notice, most long range scopes have a parallax adjustment on the side. Now this is not the parallax, this is for the reticle brightness, but this is the parallax adjustment. It's also called a side focus. Many scopes from the factory, the cheaper models, or uh, let's just use for instance a very X1 that doesn't have a side focus, they're naturally parallax between about 174 yards and 200 yards. And that's because the average person doesn't shoot farther than that. So if you buy a long range scope, I don't care what the brand is, it's got to have parallax adjustment. So I'm going to go ahead and have Cayenne get set on the gun like she's getting ready to shoot. And the first thing I want to do is teach people something that I like to teach in our shooting school called a parallax exercise. So go ahead and turn the parallax all the way clockwise till it stops. And what she'll notice is that the target's going to be really, really blurry. Okay? All right, Cayenne, what I want you to do is shake your head yes like you're talking to somebody. What's the reticle doing? It's all over the place. So it's floating all over the target. So basically what she's done is she's turned the parallax out so much that basically the target and the reticle are on two different focal planes. And as she moves her head up and down, the reticle's actually moving, which means you could literally miss your shot from shot to shot to shot. So what I like to teach my students is parallax must be adjusted at every range you go to, right? So go ahead and put your scope in focus now. So she'll turn it all the way till it gets crystal clear. Now, why she's doing that, let me kind of explain something. I'm old, she's young. Her eyes, her focus, and her parallax might be the same, mine or not. So very seldom is my target actually in clear focus, but my parallax is. So let's go ahead and ask her a question. What's your crosshair doing now when you shake your head yes? Not moving. So they're not moving, that means she's in parallax. Let's say that you still had a little bit of movement. So what she would do is go ahead and put her hand on the parallax adjustment. And while she's shaking her head up and down, yes, she'll slowly adjust her parallax until the crosshairs stop moving. Once they've stopped moving, she's in parallax. She can engage her target. I'm James. And I'm Cayenne. And we're at Barber Creek Shooting Academy at www.barbercreek.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more shooting tips.